My friend and I came through a door. The name of the story that I chose was The Haunted House of Shadows because uh, Thomas's horror movie sensibility kind of spoke to my vibe, and so I thought it'd be easy to talk about stuff that I like. I was excited to choose that story because when I was a little kid, I was afraid of everything, and I never ever like I was afraid to watch Scooby Doo. Like I was scared of the color red. I was just a paranoid little child. And when I got to college, I started to like watch horror movies with my friends and. Now I love all that stuff, and I was like, wow, this is a 10-year-old kid who is like mad brave to be like, not only am I going to engage with the horror material, but I'm going to write my own, I'm going to generate something creepy, and I'm like, dang, that kid's brave, man. In the haunted house of shadows. Hey man, take care of your friends and your family, and you know, horror movies are awesome, and horror stuff is super fun because it lets us like practice bravery. But the world's a scary place, and it can be a lot less scary if we all are just working on like being peaceful and loving each other and treating other people the way we want to be treated. And then we just watch horror stuff for fun on the side. Look, I'm praying it's a dream on the vampires and witches. We had a plan, but there were hitches. How Friday night turned so dang vicious in the haunted house of shadows. In the haunted house of shadows I'll be the ween if you be the hallows In the haunted house of shadows